Hi everyone, Stacey's here. That was Tito. But then baby squeaked the new French fry toy that I just bought him, so he took off. Anyways, what I have here is I have a box. It's a mystery box. I've been buying them off of Poshmark, Mercari, Depop. Um, this one I actually watched Abadabs open up a couple un mystery box unboxings from her. So I decided to give her a chance because I had... I don't know. I haven't had the greatest luck with the mystery ones I've been getting. They've really kind of just been full of like junk, really. One of them I thought was going to be like really good because she's like, well, with her job, she gets all this free stuff, blah, blah, blah. And yeah, it didn't work out very well. Um, I don't know if I posted those videos or not, but so we're going to do this one first. I will link her site below and I'll also link Abadab's channel on here if, um, I don't really know what the rules are as far as, I mean, I'll, um, I'll message her and ask and see if it's okay. So I'll, I won't post until, um, until she responds on Instagram. I won't put her link before. Cause I don't know. Are you allowed, just allowed to post link whoever's channel you want below? I don't know. All right. Anyways, this is what we really want to see. I don't want to see what's in here, but I will link her store below. Oh, I did the $69 one. Hmm. I may be wrong. This may not be the right one. Okay. So, there is, it's like that. It's got some glitter in it. Um... And it's got a little unicorn on there. So now that that's off, it's got all pink in there. Oh, okay. So this, uh, this is it. So this, there's this little car. She's got this in there and it says, please do not open until after unboxing if you want to be surprised. So this is the price list. So let's do this. Let's put a bag in here. I can put all these in. Oh, there's these cute little. Oh, this is on a. So this is Lil Amy G eight seventeen. Thank you so much for shopping my Poshmark closet, and it's got little unicorn things on it, and then smile pop open here. I think that anybody that smiles automatically looks better. Diane Lane. So that's cute. And then leave a little sparkle wherever you go. Well, and then it looks like there's another card in here. So I guess I will open this. And thank you so much for your purchase. Oh, I bought the $79 mystery box which is valued at over 180. The Milani items are free gifts and were not included in the calculation. So there must be Milani stuff in here and she doesn't include that. I, I saw somewhere she opened and it was um, butterflies and stuff. I actually love that this is unicorns. I used to collect unicorn and hot air balloon stuff when I was little. So it's just kind of cool how, you know, I ended up with unicorn stuff instead of the butterflies. All right. Now everything is wrapped separately in there, mostly. So we've got two of the Milani Ludicrous Lip Glosses in the shade Teen Spirit and She's All That. So these are not included in the price. These are just extras that she sent. I like those. I don't want to swap them because I don't know what I'm going to keep and I don't want to be wasted. So, and then I'm just going to package up like this. So, this is the Pure 4 in 1 Correcting Dark Spot Corrector. Looks like that. 
what? Let me open this other one just so I can do the prices at the same time. I'll just try and that. Pure primer, $33. Okay, and then the next we have is this, and I can already see it's something in Staycation is the color. Oh, Huda Beauty. I've never tried. I did get her some palettes I bought from Ipsy for like, I don't know, whatever it was an anon. But, um, I don't know. She really does keep copying everybody, so I just don't know. But anyways, there it is. Huda Beauty Power Bullet Matte Lipstick. I mean, obviously, it's a good thing to get in this box. I'm not saying it's bad. It just, I probably not. I'm not it won't even open right now. So I'm not even going to bother trying to open it right now. Okay, and it looks like that retails for $25. Holy crap. I didn't know her lipsticks were that much. And then we have the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes 4-in-1 Mascara. And it looks like that's $23. I've had that before. Can't remember if I liked it or if I gave it away. Okay, and then this is I Dream of Unicorns, and it's so cute. I really do like I am glad I did this one. This is definitely worth it. And this is a, oh, I'm going to keep this one. YSL Lipstick in Beige, beige Tribute. I've never had a YSL Lipstick. Yeah, I guess that is kind of beige, but it almost looks kind of purpley, too. I'm probably going to keep that, for sure. Oh, and that is 38. Oh, and then this is wrapped with this with little stickers on it. And this is another cute beauty duo eyeliner pencil and liquid so it must have pencil and liquid and this is an extreme black so that is $25 and then this is wrapped in like this this looks like a palette maybe Oh, this is more Milani, so this is not included in the price, and she doesn't have it on my price list. So this is, ooh, these are pretty. Milani, Most Wanted in Rosie Revenge, and Partner in Crime. This one's wrapped like this. Oh, this is a palette. Let's see who's this from. This is what's not working that way. Alright, here we go. Ooh, NARS eyeshadow palette. Voyager eyeshadow palette in Nectar? Is that what it is? Yep. Those are pretty. All nice neutrals. So that's cool. She definitely, I mean, takes into account. I personally like a lot of color and stuff, but she takes into account that not everybody's going to want all that. So she goes with some neutral colors. I'm definitely going to order another one. And then, oh, and that is 
$32. Then last thing. Ooh, an Urban Decay Single Shadow in Sin. I almost read it backwards and said Miss. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. <sighs> I don't want to open it up the other way because what if I don't use it? I can't even get it open right now. But anyways, there it is. I can't tell if it's a purplish or... Well, it's probably like that. <clears throat> okay, and the retail value for that was $20. So the grand total is $196. And that doesn't even include the freebies of the Milani and stuff that she threw in. So, yeah, I'm really happy with this box i totally want to buy more i think when i bought this this was the last one but i think she restocks a lot um she's probably gotten a whole load of new customers after watching abadabs um i think abadabs is close up oh yeah because she was doing it for one of her giveaways for or i don't know i can't remember but i think she's up close to a certain uh, certain breakthrough whatever um subscribers not breakthrough count i don't even know what i'm talking about anymore all right you guys have a good day and i will talk to you later